there's a little update on my Anhope Smart Hydroponic System. At this point, I'm sowing my seeds, hoping for some good stuff, getting everything ready for fall. Because like I said, I primarily use my uh, Anhope as a seed starting station. Now, if you plan on leaving it indoors and just growing indoors, just keep in mind you'll have to constantly trim the roots because they will grow along and uh, get into the pump. And you also have to harvest more frequently as well as change your water more often. Also keep in mind that whatever you're growing is going to have some limitations because the light will only grow up so far. And then lastly, if you are going to use it as an indoor garden, you want to make sure you probably um, space out. but do make like little caps to fill in the um, holes so that instead of using every single hole and growing something, you kind of give it space in between. Uh, I think that'll be best if you plan on using it as an indoor so that it doesn't overcrowd and you'll have one plant overgrow and kind of block light and uh, crowd out other plants. And at this point, I think I'm gonna sow some large leaf basil. I had pretty good success with that. Um, also, I got picked up some Komatsu, uh, Komatsu greens from Baker's Creek, as well as some Tatsoi greens from Baker Creek. So I'm gonna get them bad babies in there and uh, hopefully get some brassicas, you know, by the time it fall hits. So, Sewing with the a hope gardening is super easy. I got it.